Alright guys, welcome back to TA Force Gaming and today I'm going to show you how you can spoof your GPS location all right, on your Android or iOS devices all right? and the best part is there's no need to jailbreak your devices at all, all right? and this can be a very very useful tool if you want to spoof your location either for privacy issues all right, or you know playing some geolocation based games all right, that requires you know the geolocation and you can spoof your location and you know can play move around you know in a game world in at the comfort of your own home without you physically being there or you know you can spoof other you know apps that uses geolocation like snapchat all right or any um you know like live 360 etc etc all right so today all right i'm gonna talk about this software right here right so this is the tenor share i any go all right i'll be using this software for quite some time to spoof my location all right so yeah this software can work on both android and ios devices and you and the best part about this software is you do not have to jailbreak your device at all so this thing is super safe and super reliable i've been using it for a long time all right to spoof my location on my android phone and as well as you can do it on your iphone as well like i said all right and um yeah this thing has a lot a lot of features which i'm going to talk about um i'm going to show you guys you know the features what kind of things that you can do all right on this software itself so without further ado let me just go ahead and show you the software itself let's go okay so this is the software itself as you guys can see they have a lot of different modes that you can use or right, to spoof on your your, your you know your device location so you got um like change location single spot movement multi-spot movement joystick movement and jump teleport which i'm going to explain to you guys all right one by one so you guys can see how it actually works okay so right now i'm going to just connect my phone all right to my pc and uh let me just connect to my pc Okay, uh, yeah, so you can see, okay, let me just bring up Google Maps. Okay, um, all right, and I just need to end, click on enter. Okay, so I just click on enter. You can see my device is detected. So I'm on my Samsung phone. All right, so this also works wirelessly. All right, um, but this only works on uh, iOS. So if you have iOS, you can use it wirelessly as well. So it's really cool. Just select your device, click on next. Okay, so once, you know, uh, okay, so it's, it shows you, you know, it's running in the background. Okay, so now you can see this is the map and this is the location I am at. So, uh, yeah, so my one is the change location mode, which is very, very uh, simple. Okay, so, uh, so probably like I choose this point, if I double click this point, you guys can see the location, the longitude and latitude, the distance as well. So, um, once you, if you want to go here, all right, I just need to click on start to modify. All right, you just need to make, ensure you know all these warnings. If you're okay with that, just click on continue. All right, and if you go to my, if I go and tap and you know show my current location, you can see that I am over here. You guys can see. This is my location over here. So yeah, you can go anywhere I want. You guys can see which road you want, start to modify. Okay, and after that, you can see my location has been changed. So it's really, really awesome. You can just, you know, change around. Really cool. Okay, and uh, let me just show you guys the uh, single spot movement. So what uh, this single spot movement is, all right, it will go from one point to another point. Okay, so probably I select another boy point right over here. Okay, so this is my point. All right, you can select, you know, the speed. Okay, you can select the um, the number of times the coordinate will point will move around the route or it would be a round trip or a loop trip all right so you can select the speed as well okay if i go with the like riding speed you can see the distance okay so if once you have two sweat click on start navigation all right it will create an actual route all right so if you will you know an actual route for you to move so you can see this is the actual route to move to there all right to make it more realistic all right especially probably like in live 360 or snapchat all right to make it looks more realistic if someone is tracking you you know it looks like you know you're actually moving or driving you know it's very cool so because you click on start to move you'll move at the speed that you specify here all right so yeah uh, you can see it is moving at a speed they specify so it's really really cool and then you will end off at you know the, the end point so yeah you can pause anytime you can continue you can stop all right so once i stop you know it's stopped all right and the and you can see that you know you can although you can choose anywhere but i'm singapore so i'm gonna demonstrate in singapore okay so yeah this 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 software works anywhere you are in the world okay so not only limited to singapore only okay so if, just to get this clear 
Alright, and what is the multi-sport movement? Multi-sport movement is very similar to single sport movement, but you can put multiple waypoints. You can see that. Okay, so I can put multiple waypoints. You can see the amount of waypoint that will be going through. Alright, especially in those games that you know, um, maybe at this area there is some really cool creatures or what, and this area there's some really cool creatures. Alright, you just set your waypoints and you will move, and you know you can capture the creature, fight the creature, you know whatever you want over there. You can select the same uh, statistics you want. Alright, the speed. Alright, you can set driving speed as well. Alright, you can see a dist the distance, the start point, and then the whole route itself. Okay, so once it's done, click on start to move. <coughs> Alright, and it will move. But the thing about this different from that one is this will just move in a straight line. So it will just hit through all the buildings. It will not like find the route, best route for you. Alright, so it will just go go straight. Alright, but if I stop it right now. Alright, if I go to navigation mode. Okay. So if I click on like that. Okay, so if I select three areas. I click on start to move. Alright, this will be... Alright, go in the actual route. You can see, alright, you, you, it's the actual route that's being mapped out for this three destination. So yes, yeah, so you can either choose, you know, navigation mode, which they will give you uh, actual routes, or, you know, you guys can choose with the straight mode. You just go straight. So you know that you have the flexibility to do so. So you know it's very similar to single spot, but you know you can put in multiple spot to go to. All right, and the next one is the joystick movement. So what the joystick do? It's pretty much self-explanatory. Okay, so you can select the speed. Okay, so you can like you know you can see this uh, modify location to this. All right, you can start modify positioning. Okay. So you can also teleport in joystick mode, all right. But if you want to move it manually, all right, you select the speed you want to move at. All right, for me it's the car. I just need to bring the joy, joy, joystick around. You can see the direction I'm moving in. So I'm moving. You can see my joystick. I'm facing it downwards. All right, towards the um, you know, bottom right. You can see that's why it's moving in the direction. So you know you can use the joystick to move around freely, and your GPS will move around freely as you go so yeah this is the joystick mode so it's pretty much self-explanatory all right and we once is the jump teleport mode so you may see you just click on here okay you can also select multiple waypoints but this does not move okay so what does this do is they will just jump to the next point jump to the next point so where you are like probably this area you need to do something over here once you're done here you just click on next one you move to the next waypoint that you have set so it is very very awesome okay so yeah do you have um the flexibility on how you know you want to spoof your gps all right most of the software updates you know uh, gps spoofer they probably just you know just you know you press a point you just teleport there and that's all right but this one you got so much thing to do all right and so much flexibility and control over it that you know you can even fake it to look very very realistic and they even have a cooldown time as well so you can um, set certain time after the time you will jump to the next point so it's really cool but you know probably some of you guys you know you want you know the location address but you don't know where to pinpoint on the map just type in the address you want to so probably like um you know if i type in like you know the postal code if i know the postal code you can see all right it will show as the fifth waypoint or if you know the address all right all right there we go okay you know techno link the sixth point so yeah you if you know the address you can also in input the address here and they will give you the waypoint itself so it's really really awesome all right and um yeah you can have multiple devices connected to this so yes you can spoof multiple device at once which is really amazing so if you're doing like a multiple device spoofing this software does support it okay and uh, you, you can fake you have fake your favorite like certain areas certain waypoints that you want to visit in the future again or right, you can scan for like certain pokestop and gyms this one is mainly for you know uh, other games all right you can have all these you can export import you can zoom in zoom out okay so yes you can uh, and you can return to your original position okay so um yeah i think i disconnected my device accidentally but uh yes so um so yeah, okay, so I'm back to my original position, right, um, but uh, yeah, let me just stop my recording over here.
Okay, so as you guys seen, this software is pretty much very robust and very, very, you know, feature packed. Alright, so um, yeah, I we'll highly recommend this, you guys, this software if you guys are looking for really, really good, alright, um, software to um to really spoof your phone safely all right without any issues at all this is the software i would highly recommend you guys to go for all right so yeah if you guys want to check out this software i will link them the first link in the video description down below for you guys to check it out all right and like i said this thing is really really safe and really reliable i don't have any issues with it all right and no jailbreaking breaking is neither i think that's one of the best part about this software all right and this software also support mac os so if you're using your mac you can definitely use this all right and you guys can download it and try it out for free and if you guys really like it and you want to unlock more features i highly recommend you guys to get the paid version all right it is definitely very worth your money so once again if you guys want to check out this software i'll link them the first link in the video description down below for you guys to go ahead and try out for yourself all right so that's all for today guys if you find this video really interesting let me know in the comment section as well and if you guys want more video like this in the future also let me know in the comment section as well and without further ado this is jforce gaming and i shall see you guys in my next video peace out i don't want to cry